Okay, now we will animate our character in the cascader. So first of all, very important thing. Uh, here you will have to find its uh, root point. I don't know how to say this. We have clicked here, double click on it, and we will have to select all of the uh, parts, all of the buttons, and click on this button. It will make all of the buttons uh, blue. And after that, if you will double click it again, and if you will click on this button again, so as you can see, it has fixed our pose. It has, has fixed basically all of the all of the sections. Yes, the um, fingers are broken, but this is not so important. We can fix this this later. So basically, it is done. And then uh, we will do the simple movements. Let's say it like this. Uh, I will create just a simple movement. So what will I do? I will rotate my character a little bit. Then I'm selecting uh, the K form, the K. Uh, where I would like to place the K frame. For example, here, click the button F on the K board. This will place me the K so I can continue with the animation. I'm selecting the body parts which I would like to move. So for example, this one is and this one. I need my hand to move exactly with my with my body. And let's say that in this point I will move him, I don't know, like this, maybe. Okay. And I need the last point. So uh, I'm clicking on the button shift on the keyboard and the middle button on my mouse. So I'm just copying, basically duplicated. At this point here, we have the three, three points. Click here on its name, then select the interpolation, for example, the brassier, make it simple. And uh, let's click the button uh, X on the keyboard to take a look what we have. So basically, as you can see, I have here the simple movement of this character. Of course, to make the animation, we will need more movements, but basically uh, the simple steps is, is like this. So you can take a look from all sides and continue working here basically as you would like.